This is JB's Baseball Cards, here today with a card opening video of 2021 Top Series 2 Baseball. Uh, I grew up collecting Series 1, Series 2, and Update Series. I didn't even know there was another type of uh, product besides this for a long time when I grew up collecting. So I'm definitely excited. This will be my first video of Series 2 this year. Uh, Fernando Tatis Jr. is on the cover. Um, and uh, it's pretty much just a continuation of Series 1. So, uh, 330 cards in the set, so there's a total of 660 in Series 1 and 2 combined. Um, I checked the odds, and it looked like maybe just based on the odds and how it's twice as easy, I feel like, to hit a certain parallel based on the odds. So, um, definitely they print a lot less of this as opposed to Series 1, so that makes it uh, more valuable per card. Um, I got this at Walmart for... $12. I used a $1 off coupon that you could get in Series 1 Blasters. Uh, you get 67 cards in a hanger box, and overall I'd say it's a really good value. Probably one of the best values per um, per dollar in retail. I'm going to go ahead and the insert section's in the middle. I'll go ahead and go with the top half here. There's Framber Valdez. Uh, the design, the back, it's all similar to or the exact same to Series 1 except for different players. There's Dustin May, Daniel Bard, Ken Giles, Josh Naylor. So I'm looking at the uh, new players. The only thing different is just the players, and it's cool to see some of the new images, and sometimes you can see images you like and are cool and the players are having fun. There's Tyler Glass now, Carson Kelly, JT Real Muto, there's a good one for me as a Cubs fan, Chris Bryant. Um, definitely like collecting all the Cubs. Hopefully he's playing really well. Hopefully they keep keep up the good work and uh, do well through the All-Star break so they can be buyers instead of sellers. Clint Frazier, Nathan Eovaldi, Brandon Belt, Herman Marquez, Walker, Granke, Cabrera. There's a nice one. Braylon Marquez rookie. He's the only Cubs rookie in uh, Series 2 this year. Um... I notice in Series 1, usually most years, I feel like has a better um, assortment. There's Wilson Contreras, his brother William Contreras. Has a better assortment of star players than Series 2 does and update series. But um, I guess it's different every year. But I feel like they usually hold back fewer, uh, you know, everyday stars uh, for Series 2 than they do for Series 1. That's a cool one, Jason Hayward. I always like pictures up against the Wrigley Field Ivy. There's Austin Slater, Chris Sale, Will Myers. This might be a short print or something. Nope, I could tell by the code on the back. And one reason I really do like uh, retail this year is the um, retail exclusive inserts. And here is one, a chrome 1965 design of Pete Alonzo. Really cool. The 1965 design is one of my favorites. I like the back of the card being uh, sort of blue color. So that's a really cool card there. Uh, Kim for the Cardinals, Rookie Cup. That's pretty cool. Here is a rookie, Sam Huff. This is a 70 Years of Tops. That's a cool one. And Justin Verlander, 1986 Design All-Star. And in these hanger boxes, you get four uh, just uh, cardboard uh, 1965 reprints, and I like these a lot. Here's Javi Baez, Joe Adele. Francisco Lindor, and Nolan Arenado. And you get two, with it being from Walmart, two uh, royal blue parallels. Here's Victor Robles and Kevin Kramer. That picture was taken at Wrigley Field. I always like to flip over um, the cards before and after the insert section just to make sure that I didn't miss a, a short print or a uh, parallel card because they do 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 that sometimes without uh, you being able to tell by them flipping it over so I'm enjoying the new images this year there's Ryan Weathers rookie card he pitched against the Cubs uh, Craig Kimbrell is having a great year he should be an all-star closer uh, I think his ERA is well under one and he's doing a really good job so I definitely do like looking at the new images with series two after a while, you see the same uh, players and pictures from Series 1, so you get tired of it. But same design, but still new players and new images make for a 
Definitely exciting time with Series 2. Jonathan Villar, McClanahan, Cole Calhoun. I think I forgot to mention that some of the best rookies to look for in Series 2 are Key Brian Hayes and Alex Kirilov. Um, there's a few other good ones, um, but I don't think we're, we're ever we're going to find out for another year or two who the best ones will be. But I'd say that was a pretty good hanger box there. Uh, my first one on the video this year. Go ahead and go through the highlights as a Cubs fan. Show off all the Cubs cards too. There's a Victor Robles and Kevin Kramer blue parallels. A Kim Rookie Cup foil. That's pretty good. Sam Huff, 70 years of tops. That's like the 2001 design, I believe. Verlander insert. A couple of really nice 65 design inserts. I really like this Pete Alonzo chrome card. And I got a few more Cubs here. So overall, I'd say a really good box. Just hitting my uh, PC and also hitting some really cool insert cards like this Alonzo 65 Chrome. Uh, thanks for watching. Let me know if you've had any success finding this. I saw they had a blaster and hanger boxes at my Walmart. I'm not sure if they're doing fat packs or um, other very vari other variations of the product, but uh, I know Meyer usually does blister packs, so I'll definitely be looking for those. And if I find some, I'll definitely try to make a video of those for the channel. Uh, thanks for watching. Hope you're having a good day. Please like, comment, and subscribe, and I'll see you in the next video. Thank you.